Brought to you in part by the website yazlawyer.com. From a U.S. study say it's true, you will probably end up looking just like your mother when you're older. That includes wrinkles, sagging skin, and all of that. Here to talk more about this study is Dr. Matthew Knight with the Knight Dermatology Institute. Good morning, doctor. Good morning. Thanks again for having me. Thank you for coming in. Okay, so we have to put it out here. It's not necessarily a bad thing to look like mom. Our moms are pretty cute. We look like them most of the time. Of course not. It's not a bad thing at all. But what they look like now, if I were to look at my mom at, let's say, age 60, am I going to look like that at age 60? Well, here's what happened. A group of plastic surgeons from Loma Linda University in California presented a, a study at the American Society of Plastic Surgery meeting out in Washington. And they took 10 groups of moms and their daughters looking at how they age. And in this case, they only looked around the eyes. And they used these really fancy 3D models and imaging uh, equipment. And they, they found that daughters age almost just like their mothers with respect to just underneath the eyes. So like the and, eye wrinkles and circles. Right. And in the middle, especially like the, the mid part of your eye and through here especially, that's where they age the same. And so there's, there's taking that to say, well, if we can predict how daughters age by looking at their mothers, we can plan rejuvenation down the road, saying if your mom looks this way, you're going to need your eyelids done at age 40 Start or saving 45. up your money. Start saving your money now. Okay, right. what about genetics? Can you fight it? Because what if you have different, I guess, diet or habits than your mother? Yeah, of course. I, I think what this study lacks is that it doesn't take into account all the environmental factors that come into our lives. In Central Florida, we get a lot of sun exposure, and we all know that leads to wrinkling and pigment spots, uh, smoking, other environmental stresses weren't taken into account in this study and they only studied 10 people or 10 groups of people okay. so there's a lot left to do but it's interesting because this is the first time that it's been done scientifically looking at it in 3d and ultrasound without just saying that it looks the same all very interesting. Before we go, real quick, you said if I want to look hot like my dad, probably not very likely because he's got an advantage. Well, you know, men do tend to have thicker skin and they age a little bit uh, more gracefully than women do just because of the thickness of their skin. But you bring up a really good point. Remember that we're not, we don't just have our mother's chromosomes, we have both parents. So there's a little bit more to this story than, than I think we hear here, but it's an interesting start. All right, we'll have to talk more again sometime. Dr. Knight, thank you so much Thanks for coming so much. in. Right now, we do have to talk about the